In Texas alone, there are more than 1300 missing person cases. That means hundreds of families left with no answers. KETK News is retracing the tracks of nearly 100 of these people. Tonight, Trent Bennett introduces us to our first case. Trent. AC, August 3rd, 2016 was just a regular day in Malakoff, Texas, but for one family, it was the start of a search for a missing family member. His name, Kevin Dwayne Lemons. Lemons' mother-in-law, Zebra Gamble, says they assume he went to a convenience store somewhere in the Caney City area. After that, the rest is up in the air. Now, the family tells us that Lemons left a suicide note in his car. The car was found in Trinidad, but he was not. I didn't notice anything out of the ordinary. And he just said, oh, I forgot cigarettes. Could I run back and get a pack? And I was like, sure, you know, go ahead. But the car was locked. Hey, he took his cell phone, he took his wallet, he took his car keys. Um, to me, that's not somebody, somebody wouldn't do that if they were going to harm themselves or something. Lemons, as you see, there was a father. This letter around Christmas from his son saying, Dad, I don't know where you are, but I hope you have a good holiday. We have nearly 100 other unsolved mysteries like Lemons. All you have to do is go over to our website. You'll see vanished, missing in East Texas with each name and the individual with the information that we have been able to attain here in our newsroom. Reporting live in the studio, Trent Bennett, KETK News.